It's America Says. And here to fill in the blanks, John Michael Higgins. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hello, everybody, and welcome. In this game, the parent crew will be competing against master escape artists for a chance to win $15,000. Parent crew, you will be up first, as you know. You know how to play this game. I'm going to put a bunch of blanks up. You're going to take them down. 100 points every time you get one right. If you get them all right in 30 seconds, I know you will. Yes. You're going to get 1,000 bonus points right here in round one, OK? That makes sense? Yes. Michael? Yes. You're the tallest, so you're the team captain, OK? Yes. You ready for that? Yes, I am. Let's do it, Michael. We asked America. In our family, it's a tradition to blank on Christmas Eve. Something you all do on Christmas Eve. And our top seven answers, go. Eat. Pray. Squirrel. Santa. <laughs> Shopping. Uh, davening. <laughs> Bathe. Uh, reindeer? <laughs> Slay. Go to Georgia. Oh, tough board. Well done, though. You had some very creative answers there. <laughs> I like that. It's Christmas Eve, so the whole family bathes together. <laughs> Out in the living in the living room. <laughs> yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? You know. And then they go to Georgia. So uh, anyway, yeah, you did pull two down off your board, and that's 200 points to start your round one. Well done. Thank you. Okay, master escape artists. <laughs> Hi, welcome to the show. It's so nice to have you here. I'm going to chat with you in just a moment. For that, you have a lot of blanks up there. You can pull down there 100 points apiece. Do you like the GTG, O, P, D, S, or B, something you do on Christmas Eve? O and P. O, P. Uh-huh. This is what we look forward to the most, and that's opening presents. Ah, yes. That'll do it. We, that's what we do. Opening. We open all of them on Christmas Eve. Uh, some people object to that. Do you have a problem with that, Vanessa? Not at all. Well, thank you, Vanessa. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, let's see if it's up there. Opening presents. Yep, there it is. Good, that's 100 points. You haven't even started your round yet, but you got it correct, so you want to keep trying? Yeah, we got to catch an early flight, so we're going to go with GTG to because we got to go to grandma's. Go to grandma's. <laughs> Interesting. I didn't see that, of course. It fits, too. Let's see if it's up there. Go to grandma's. Yay! Yeah, look at that. <laughs> SD and B, what do you say? Let's go with B. Okay. Once we get to grandma's, we love to bake. Bake. Interesting. Okay, good. Let's see if it's up there. Bake. Yep. Yay! Nice job. S and D, what do you think? Once our cousins get to grandma's, we like to D, drink. <laughs> okay, drink. <laughs> I like to drink, too. And I don't care if it's not Christmas Eve. Here we go. Drink. Yep. Yay! You've taken the lead in the game. You haven't even started your round yet. What do you say? Can you get that 400 up to 500 points by pulling that last S off the board? S, and we're just so joyous together, so we'll sing. Sing. Nice. I didn't see that coming. Of course, let's see if it's sing. It sure yeah. is. Well done. All righty, look at that. You're going to start your first round with 500 points in the bank. Uh, before we do that, I would love to meet the master escape artist. Very intriguing. What do you say, Kristen? Could sure. you introduce us? Yeah, I am Kristen. This is my sister, Katrina, mm -hmm. her lovely husband, Henry. And all the way down there is my husband, Aaron. And He's we... lovely, too. <laughs> <laughs> and we love to do escape rooms. We actually have done 100 escape rooms with a 90% escape rate. So if you have a 90% escape rate, why are you here? Uh, <laughs> you got out of that room somehow. All right. What about you, Katrina? How are you on the escape room? Uh, when we do escape rooms, we all have certain roles. Where my sister here, she's the brain master. She does all the puzzles. She's very organized, mm. whereas I am doing locks and keys. Um, Henry, my husband, takes leadership, so you don't want to cross him. Um, mm. And then Aaron here, he's our brave soul. The bravest one, Aaron? Is that right? I don't know, but I like to go wherever they are scared to do anything. You go for the scary ones. Yeah. I can't do the scary ones. Sometimes coffins. Coffins? Yeah. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to be locked in a... 
pay to be locked in a car. <laughs> they actually have a nice story about an escape room. <laughs> I love escape rooms so much, I proposed to my wife in an escape room. Holy cow. <laughs> That's an interesting strategy. You didn't give her an out. Yeah, there's no escape. There's no escaping. <laughs> there was no escape. No wonder you're married. Well, good heaven. Congratulations. I, thank you. <laughs> well, welcome to the show, uh, Master Escape Artist. Thank so you. nice to have you here. You have 500 you. points to start your round. Kristen, we're going to start with you as a team captain. You ready for that? Kristen, we asked America. Oh, great. My neighbor is in college, and he just invited the whole blank over. Unwelcome guests. Top seven answers. Go. Class. Football team. Soccer. Fraternity. Dance. Sorority. Um, ball. Dream. Diving. Singers. School. Uh, band. Dance. And time, look at that. Oh, so close. Wow, what a team. A really good run there for the Master Escape artists. You were adding to your 500 points, and you now have 1,100 points right here in round one. Well done. Parent crew, conversing with yourselves, trying to figure out what that D might be. I'll give you 100 points for it, Michael, if you can pull that down. Dean? The dean? Like the, oh, dean, like in a college. Let's give the dean a try. Is it the dean? It's not the dean. Uh, I knew what it. is it? Dorm. dorm. Whole dorm, the whole dorm came over. All right, after one round of play, the parent crew has 200 points. Master escape artists are ahead with 1,100 points. We're only getting started here. Come on back for more of America Says right after this. Welcome back to America Says. After one round of play, the parent crew has 200 points. The master escape artists are ahead with 1,100 points. It's round two. Correct answers are now worth 200 points apiece. If you run the board this time, so close last time, master escape room artists, you're going to get 2,000 bonus points added to your score. Let's go over here to the parent crew. Uh, before I get you into round two, I would love to meet the parent crew. Michael, could you help me out? Yes, my name is Michael. Thanks for having us. This is my lovely fiance, Vanessa, and our two good friends, Brett and Pam. Welcome. Thank you very much. Parent crew, what's that all about, Vanessa? Well, our kids met um, while they were in kindergarten. So kindergarten parents, yes. at right. some point, I won't ask when, ladies. <laughs> How are the kids doing? Are, are they still friends? They're well, great friends. Best friends. Besties. Are they really? Oh, yes. yeah. yeah. You got lucky. Sometimes it doesn't work that way. It's like yeah. the parents are madly in love and the kids hate each other. <laughs> <laughs> happens all the time. Do you have any other children, Michael? Yeah, I have a 15, we have a 15, 16 year old. What is it? 16. 16. There you go. 16. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Ours is 15, his is yeah. 16. Yeah. You're 15. Yeah. Yeah. You might have confused the kids at one point. Yeah. <laughs> Just double check the tag on the kids. It's that it's at the right house. Anyway, I'm so glad you all found each other and that your kids are still best friends. It's wonderful. I yes. love that story. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming, Parent Cruz. Lovely to meet you. You have 200 points from your first round. Let's see if we can beef that up and chase those master escape room artists. Vanessa, we're going to start with you on this one. You ready for that? Ready. Let's do it. We asked America. A blank is a vehicle you might rent on vacation. A vacation rental vehicle. Top seven answers. Go. Dune buggy. Boat. Kayak. Uh, cruise. <laughs> a car. Um, raft. Jet ski. RV. Bicycle. Yeah, look at that. There it is. Fantastic. 2,000 bonus points. Wonderful work. That brings your total to 3,600 points. Yes, see, that's the way it works on this show. You were so worried you had a low score, and this is what <laughs> happens. Look at that. All right. Uh, that was very exciting. They did it. You can do it, too. Katrina, it's going to start with you. You ready for that? Yes. Katrina, we asked America. I walked in on my husband in the tool shed using his blank. <laughs> All of you, get out of this room. <laughs> Our top seven answers. Go. Hammer. 
Shredder. Screwdriver. Drill. Pliers. Um, hammer. Saw. Grill. Hammer. Hunting. Gorilla tape. House. Hanger. Garage. And time. <laughs> nice run. Look at that. Well done. Those were tough at the end there. You had a really nice run. Five correct. That brings your score way up to 2,100 points right here in round two. Well done. Parent crew, they had a nice run as well. They did leave a couple for you. 200 points apiece for a G and an H, and it's something in a tool shed. Michael, what do you think? Ho? A ho. Okay. <laughs> Boy, this just gets worse and worse, doesn't it? <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's <laughs> yeah, I know what a ho is. <laughs> Was he using a hoe? <laughs> Could it be a hose? Oh. Yeah, oh. all right. And the G is for a grinder. That's the other one. All righty, after two rounds of play, the master escape artist had 2,100 points. The parent crew jumped ahead with 3,600 points, and that's anybody's game. When we return to America, says only one of these teams will be crowned the winner. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back to America. Says after two rounds of play, the master escape artists are up to 2,100 points. The parent crew jumped ahead, 3,600 points. Whichever team has more points after this round, we'll play the bonus round for a chance at $15,000. In round three, which is what we're doing now, 300 points every time you get one right. If you get them all right this time, parent crew, you're gonna get 3,000 bonus points. It's very hard to beat. Either team can win this thing, obviously. They're trading the lead back and forth the whole game. Parent crew, we're gonna start with you because you're a little bit ahead. Pam, we're gonna start with you as the first player. We asked America. My favorite cartoon duo is blank. A cartoon duo, top seven answers. Go. Um, um, Miss Piggy and, and Kermit. Tom and Jerry. Uh, Chip and Dale. It's not even. Ren and Stimpy. Batman and Robin. Tom. SpongeBob and Patrick. Mickey and Minnie. Superman and Spider. Oh, oh, oh nice yeah. job! Look at that. A really nice run. I was a little scared for you at the beginning there, but Sorry. You, you, you really did sort of pull it out. Five correct, look at that score. 5,100 points in the third round. Well done, parent crew. All right, they had a great run over there. Kristen, they left a couple up there. It's a P and a TB, S and S. They're both worth 300 points apiece. What do you think? We love watching this cartoon growing up. Let's go with PTB, Pinky and the Brain. Nice. Forgot about that one. Let's see if it's up there. Pinky in the brain. Yeah, well done, 300 points. Can you do that trick one more time, Kristen? Let's get that S and S off there. Michael, let's go with Scooby and Shaggy. Ah, Scooby and Shaggy. Interesting, because it's not called Scooby and Shaggy, but I think it's up there. Let's see if it's there. Scooby and Shaggy. Yeah. Great job. Okay. We have 2,700 points, and the parent crew across the street has 5,100 points. It's a lopsided score, but you can win. <laughs> okay. All you need to do is get all seven. Okay. They did, you can too. All right, let's give it a try. Henry, we're gonna start with you. 30 seconds are on the clock, possibly for the win here. We asked America. Besides pizza, the word slice makes me think of blank. Not a pizza slice, but some other slice. Top seven answers, go. Pie, apple, grape, bread, carrots. Cookies, cake, waffles. Gum, water. Watermelon, gum, cinnamon. Cheese, gold. Great. Oh, it won't be.
be enough, which means the pair crew has won the game. You four are heading off to the bonus round for a big chance at $15,000. Let's get that last answer off there. The G was for golf, a golf slice, of course. And when America says continues, parent crew will play for $15,000. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back to America Says. Parent crew have won the game, and now we'll have a chance to win $15,000. You hear that? Yes. It's a lot of money. What would parents do with $15,000? Can you tell me? We plan to go to Costa Rica. <laughs> oh, well, I see. OK, yes. that makes sense. Costa Rica, okay, yeah. all four of you. Yes. You gonna leave the kids behind? Oh, that's a good question. We have kids? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, believe me. All right, let's see if we can get you to Costa Rica. Yeah. Here's how our bonus round works. I'm gonna give you four fill-in-the-blank questions this time. If this team, excellent team, can get the answers to all of them in 60 seconds or less, you're going to Costa Rica $15,000, all right? Woo! If you have a problem, get stuck, this is a skip button. We'll just go right on to the next question. You will have to clean up that skipped question in order to get to the $15,000 eventually just put it in your head and as a team you can only use the button once so make sure you need it before you use it okay let's do it question number one we're gonna start with Michael and for the first question Michael we're only looking for our top answer 60 seconds are on the clock let's do the bonus round we asked America when I was younger I'd go to concerts and bring the fun now I bring blank our top answer Squirrel. Um, pillow. Earplugs. There it is. You got it. Woo! Earplugs it is. Took you a couple of seconds there, but you still have 51 seconds on the clock. That's a good amount of time. Let's go on to our second question. Vanessa will start us, and we're only looking for our top two answers this time. Okay, with 51 seconds on the clock, second question. We asked America. Birds can be found in blank. Top two answers. Go. Trees. And nuts. <laughs> Nests. There it is. Well done, Pam. All right. <laughs> Pam, you're on fire. We have 45 seconds. Three quarters of your time is still left. You're halfway through. So let's keep going in this vein. We're going to look for our top three answers on this one. Here we go. Pam. We asked America, a word you often hear before day is blank. Blank day. Top three answers. Go. Good. Uh, pleasant. Bad. Before. There's the skip button. Vanessa, probably wise choice. We'll have to make up that skipped question to get to the big money. We're gonna move right on to the fourth question. Top four answers is all we're looking for, and we're gonna start with Brett this time. 34 seconds on the clock should be enough time to get this done. Here we go, Brett, fourth question. We asked America, the last time I went to a roller rink, I saw a lot of blank. Top four answers. Skates. Uh, fun people. Squirrels. Fun. Kids. Friends. Fans. Sundays. Flips. <laughs> French fries. Scooters. And time. So sorry, couldn't quite get it there. Let's see what these are. At a roller rink, F, maybe falls? Yeah, and uh, the S, I'm not sure. I don't know what that is. What is this? Spandex. <laughs> All right, let's go back and get your skip dancer. I think, Pam, you may know what this is. It's before day. What's one of those? You think? Pay. Pay day, yeah, and maybe birthday? Birth? Yeah, there it is. And there it is. You have $1,000, though. Wonderful team. That's our show. We'll see you next time right here on America Says. Goodbye, America.